What is that, a reef knot? Maybe it's a blue line? Is this thing glued in there? Come on! Boom! Phew! I'll be extinct by the time I get this thing out. Yeah. A jackhammer? Oh, now we're talking. I promise I'll be careful. Uh, that might need some assembly. Something sharp around here I can use. Remember, Dr. Settler and Grant want us to be especially careful when digging up this fossil. <laughs> <laughs> I say, not as I do. Next time, I'm just bringing a sandblaster. Six-inch retractable claw, like a razor, on the middle toe. Dr. Grant, Dr. Ellie, we're ready to try again. I hate computers. Feelings mutual. Give up. You give it a try. <sighs> Careful, that rope's holding up uh, some, you know, uh, oh, don't, what's it called? Uh, no, it's delicate equipment. That's it. It was holding a bunch of delicate equipment. Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> 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 oh, I found a perfectly preserved Compsognathus thigh. Really? Uh, no. I figured out what's wrong with it. It should have two wheels, not one. And handlebars. That's why you fell off of it, Dave. No handlebars. Stop it from leaning over and going around in circles all the time. 
That's great. Now it looks like the picture in the instructions. Shoot the radar into the ground and the phone bounces the image back. Two more years, we don't have to dig anymore. There's none in that. That thing looks like a six foot turkey. You think you are? Ah. <laughs> John Hammond. I own an island. Kind of biological preserve. Really spectacular. Spared no expense. Our attractions will drive kids out of their minds. If I could just persuade you to sign off on the park, I could get back on schedule. What kind of park is this? It's right up your alley. So you two, um, dig up, dig up dinosaurs? <laughs> well... Try to. <laughs> You'll have to get used to Dr. Malcolm. He suffers from a deplorable excess of personality, especially for a mathematician. Chaotician. Chaotician, actually. <laughs>